turn in, shift down. Yes. Hold on, oh, we're going for a ride in the top rally car in the nation, and you won't believe where this car was built. I'm Shauna Litsky, and that story is coming up in tonight's Spotlight on Sports. Hold on to your stomach. <laughs> it's quite a ride, oh, thanks, oh. JJ. <laughs> People around here love auto racing, from Devil's Bowl to Thunder Road to NASCAR, but there's another segment of the car racing scene that is getting a lot of attention these days, thanks in part to a local business. Sean Alinsky and photographer Shelley Hold Allen show us in tonight's Spotlight on Sports. <laughs> attack closed sections of real public dirt roads they've never seen before, navigating twists, turns, and anything but ideal driving conditions with the help of a co-driver. Into left four open. We got a close-up look at some of these hyper-powered cars, and guess what? Welcome to Vermont Sports Car. They're built in Colchester. Basically, we take a standard car and we change it completely from the beginning to the end. Vermont Sports Car is home to Subaru of America's factory rally team. Steering wheel's good. We've been doing this since 1988 and, and very small. And over the last uh, 10 years, it's just gotten better each year. With a star in motocross sensation turned rally car driver Travis Pastrana, Vermont Sports Car has exploded onto the national scene. These are the top cars in America right now. Not only did Pastrana and Subaru Rally Team USA win this year's national championship, cars built in Colchester own the podium at this summer's X Games. This is a car that finished second at the X Games. It was driven by Colin McRae. Once these completely re-engineered WRX STIs worth over $200,000 have undergone their transformation, it's test time. Dalton, New Hampshire is where we find the Team O'Neill Rally School with six and a half miles of closed dirt roads. I'm not going to lie to you, I'm a little bit nervous. Come on, you knew I wasn't going to pass up this opportunity. Yeah! <laughs> Break hard, turn in, shift down. Yes! That by far the coolest thing I've ever done. While this is a relatively obscure sport in the U.S., it's a huge draw in Europe, and that is where Vermont Sports Car and Pastrano want to be. So we've won the U.S. Championship now, and uh, we're not settled with that. We just gotta, just gotta keep going to the top of the rally racing world, all the way from Vermont in Colchester. Shauna Litsky, Channel Three Sports. That was something like a cab ride I took in New York once. <laughs> She's not going to forget that ride. Though. That is something. Thanks, JJ.